this what you never had. Hey, hey, off the juice. Coding got me tripping. Yo, what's going on, YouTube? It's your boy KT. Uno, you know. And I'm here, man, to go ahead and kind of, I guess, help the people that are on edge. That's really on the fence right now. About the 6'9 and the 6'8. Going into 2K21. The 6'9, 6'8, yo. What are we going to do? This is, once again, I know I dropped the video, but I had to go ahead and update it because I know a lot of people have been asking me questions on Twitter. You know what I mean? Through PlayStation, yo. With my all red paint beast scales, do I go 6'8 or do I go 6'9? Now I'm gonna go ahead and give y'all first a comparison from like, you know, 2K20, how it look is obviously I'm in the My Player Builder for 2K20. I'm gonna show y'all the difference in everything for the most part that y'all can see. Boom, right here, the all red, as you can see, the offensive rebound block, defensive, all in the 95s. Then I'm showing y'all the, uh, the physicals. Cause they're not the same. In the prelude that we played, they're not the same. Set your potential, you know, I just did this how, you know, I made my legend build basically, just with a little bit of passing. But yeah, you know, a lot of people are, are really, I guess you could say troubled. What are we gonna do? Is 6 8 the new wave? I don't know, you know what I mean? It's gonna be the same question, because when I went 6 8 6 9, a lot of people, you know, they gave me a lot of grief as far as for, you know, being undersized or undersized big. You can't do it. You're going against 6'10", you know, 6'11", bigs. I started out, you know, 2K20 with a 6'10 deal. That's what it was. You know, the tallest I went probably was 6'11", you know. And um, I never really regretted it. I've always made my own wave. And that's one thing that people know about me. I always played on a small center. See, 2K20... Your weight doesn't make a difference, as y'all can see. That's why I'm really going left and right. 81 speed out the gate, you know, so with your plus nine, that's an 80 speed. With your acceleration, that's 84. Your vertical is the only thing that was cruised with the uh, all speed physical. But look at this, man. Look at the steel. 84 steel, yo. 81 perimeter defense, lateral quickness. Boom. We jump to 6'8. Your driving dunk goes up plus two. Your standing dunk goes down like five. But look at the perimeter defense, 84, lateral quickness, 79, still 85. The speed is 84, yo. So with your plus nines, it's a 93, 88 acceleration. Yo, this is demon-like. Like I said, for comp pro and stage, a lot of people was solely bought on the 6'9". I know certain people went 6'8", and, you know, that's really goaded. You know, that's on them, man. There ain't nothing wrong with that. 6A was really nasty. Once again, speed doesn't affect, uh, or your, your weight doesn't affect your speed in 2K20. And I always thought that was kind of, it didn't really make sense. You know what I mean? Because I'll be going against a 6'9 all red. The dude would be 260 pounds, 270 pounds, moving like he on demon time, moving malicious. Like my boy Will say, it's kind of crazy, you know? So I felt like that didn't really make no sense, but it is what it is. I showed y'all the 6'8 and the 6'9 for 2K20. And I'm pretty sure I'll go to uh, show you guys just my regular paint beats. You know what I mean? And um, I really enjoy it. I'm not going to lie. Being 6'9, as y'all can see right there, I have 6'8 builds. Paint beats 6'8. It's like I've been doing this, you know? A lot of people now are going to be solely bought on being 6'8 once you see the stats. You know, I don't know if the demo plans on changing anything, y'all, but right now, the 6.9 and the 6.8 looks godly. Like the all reds and 2K21 are demi god bills, you know? Uh, it's kind of really crazy. I don't really know what more they can really do with that build. It's complete. It's really complete. And um, But this year, though, as far as this year really wrapping it up, this is just kind of like the finished build. This was the ideal build besides being a legend. You know, if you weren't a legend, you had Tendos. This is what it was, you know. 88 driving, 88 standing, you know, 79 free throw, 90 speed, 84 acceleration, 80 strength. A lot of people knew that strength wasn't a thing. Well, a lot of people told me that it was. I beg to differ, so I didn't really I didn't really listen to the next person, I guess you could say. I didn't. I just did what I wanted to do. The vertical was cruised though, 77, but as long as you were in position, it was all good. 
There go your plus fours. Pretty sweet. Pretty sweet build, I'm not going to lie. I have no complaints with the 6-9. It was pretty fun being able to actually play defense. You know, it was wild like that jump from 6-10 uh, and 6-9, what it could possibly do. You know, I thought it was wild. You know, that's really mud. Like, all I could really say for the 6 9 as it broke the game, everyone knows that the 6 9 broke the game. You're able to switch, and that's really what it was. We're actually about to jump into this uh, 2K21 demo. Yeah, it's time to really go see what's the move. 6 8 or 6 9. What's the difference? Are you going to get paint mashed by 6 9 paint bees just because it's 6 8? I don't think an inch makes a difference, you know? Is it worth the drop off? Cause that's really what it was with being 6'10 and 6'9. Yo, is a 6'10 gonna paint match a 6'9? But the interior defense is high, you know? So I guess it still comes down to shot contest, you know? Intimidator, so on and so forth. So as y'all can see, yep, there you go. I ain't got my face skin, kind of disrespectful, but we gonna use that boy, uh, Che, uh, again. You know, but y'all know what it is, bro. Gotta be. You know, obviously it's the second to last pie chart for anyone who doesn't know where the all red is. Boom, 75 speed. It went from 81 to 75. I'll show y'all real quick. And this is the power four, yo. And they start you at 6'9. 75, boom. So obviously, I'm not a legend, so I'm, I'm doing my uh, <laughs> my finishing how I would want, how I would want it. Probably need like 65 free throw. I, I want that six playmaking. A lot of people might go four, they might settle for five, you know, might want break, start a goal, downhill bronze, quick first step goal, you know, that's, that's all on how you want to do it. But this is how I'm setting up my badges. I know everyone has their own meta. Yeah, six nine looking pretty good. I'm gonna go build. Boom, six nine. Now, like I said, we don't have that eighty one speed out the gate. But if you want to get glitchy, you can make them skinny. You know what I mean? <laughs> you can make them skinny, and you see the the speed goes up. Cause weight it means something now. Although you do lose strength, it gets cruised. You know. Your acceleration goes up, your vertical and your speed. Look at your, your defense though, 95, 95, or 80 still. You know, your driving dunk is at 88 already before your plus fives. Your standing dunk is a 95. Boom, let's check the 6 eight. Automatically 82 speed, so with your plus nines, you're at 91 speed, 88 acceleration, 85 vertical. No way in 2K20 was the vert getting that high it doesn't go up any higher when you decrease the weight but the speed goes all the way to 86 the lateral quickness gets jumped up even with max weight you're still moving crazy yo <laughs> like like i said man the proof is in the pudding me y'all know what i'm gonna do i'm gonna go six nine or six eight i might do both i might do both because i feel like both of these bills are great 87 driving dunk 94 standing you're 6 8 with a 94 standing dunk i'm telling you these builds yo they're complete look at your lateral quickness yo 84 <laughs> that's without tweaking the weight 6 9 let's look at 6 10 6 10 doesn't look too bad with all speed because this year they gave the um all speed just a little bit more vertical which I'm down with. You go skinny, you still got a 80, 81 interior defense. You know, you get your rim, it's right back in the 90s once you get your takeover. Yeah, man, so you already know. It's all on y'all. Everyone's gonna do their own thing, but I had to go ahead and break it down. Really detailed for y'all, cause y'all my peoples, man. Y'all already know what to do. Make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe to your boy. It's what we do, man. It's your boy KT Uno. You know. And we gone. He <laughs> dick.